Oh, someone has a drop. First kill of the day. Who is it? Who is it? Darren's got a drop. Go, Darren. Go, go, go. Oh, we got another bow piece. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my God. They're both on two bow pieces now. What the heck? Okay. Okay. Congrats. So if I'm remembering correctly, I think three of the last six items have been bow pieces for the team. Okay, coming up at two, daily challenge done, sub 14, no red drops, but lots of blood runes, lots of soul runes, lots of happy, happy smiley faces. Can I survive is the question. Boom. That's only 9k actually, 6k res. Yeah, these, uh, these hits are starting to get quite high now. I think he just splashed. He splashed twice. Oh my god, it's the freest clever. Zami staffs are actually so OP at this boss. Like the fact you can you can make him splash on P7, like it's so helpful when it works. There we go, absolutely smashing it once again. 700 bloods. I feel like this like that's less items than usual. Yeah, the seeds aren't here. Where are the seeds? Yeah, it's so much more consistent now that I'm, I'm doing that. It's like Corruption and uh, Sonic and then Surge over it makes it so much more consistent. And there we go, 19 entire million. So that's all good. Um, lovely stuff and good job team. Uh, this is like, look, look at this. Like, uh, this is the problem with Iron Man. This guy dropped like a mill of stuff and I can't pick it up. No, it's the yak, I think. All right, grab the resin. The second hit there is always a very good idea. You get a lot of, uh, a lot of benefit from that. All right, there we go. Daily challenges galore. Dude, 1955 blood runes. Oh, that's almost a PB. PB is 2025 right now. All right, there we go. Another kill done. So it's kind of like yesterday where we're just we're just not dying today. It's really great. And 1300 bloods once again. It's beautiful. Disrupt. As if we even need disrupt, Darren. <laughs> that's so much damage in so little time. It's great. Oh wait, green! Who's got green? <gasps> it's me! I've turned green! Okay! Is it my turn for a babies now? L using a luck ring helps. Okay, here goes. Good luck. Boom! <laughs> no, no, no! You've got to be kidding me! Why is this boss like this? Well, it's been a few days, but the daily boots have been reobtained, so that's good. So this is the drop vlog. Four helms, seven boots, one top, no legs. Ah, no sparkles that time, but that's another perfect hour. We got four kills and our aura didn't even run out. Like, our kill times are absolutely insane. Yar, me hearties. I got a pirate impling jar I did. Let's see what's inside. It, oh, 11k. Okay, data balloon, boogie bow, get. Boom. Do I always get oddments from these things? I don't know why. Oh my god, we're so good at this game! Wow, that was like a duo completion on like pretty high HP. We absolutely popped it. Thank you, critical hits plants. <laughs> yeah, this chain deep in back there looks very nicely. And then uh, just like four tick and ice barrage after that. And they should hopefully, if they're nice, they get stunned again. These are not nice. Alright, there we go again though. Up to... What's that? 2,620 in rage. We're flying up today. Alright, that's my final kill of today. I'm very tired now, but what a kill. We did so, so well today. I'm so proud of us. Once again, we did so well. Hey guys, look at that. Fungus boss gave nothing. Well, Jay got a torch. He doesn't want it. 
but that's all we got. And here it is, another hour of crow, no drops whatsoever, but we did get a reroll, which I guess is sort of nice, sort of-ish, maybe. Hey guys, can you guess what I'm doing? That's right, it is making Lumbridge teleport tabs because it is the best way to craft water runes, and uh, ever since Zami, even though I've been trying to be fairly efficient with my spell switching, like between Insight Fear and Exangulate, my water runes have taken an absolute nosedive. Um, so basically I had 600,000 water runes before Zuck came out, and for the first time in forever, I am below 100k. It's getting a bit scary, but I've heard that crafting them is like super duper 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 fast if you have these uh, Lumbridge teleport tabs and the Evil Dave's book, you can put them in that. Or, well, you can chip them, you know, I guess you don't have to put them inside, because that you know, saves a click, I suppose. But, regardless, um, they TP right by the water altar, and then you can runecraft happy as a daisy. So I guess I guess we could, we could demonstrate it for the first time and see what happens, that'd be a good idea, wouldn't it? Literally no idea how this is going to go, but let's get our pouches, let's get our essence. And you know what? We'll even get a power burst of sorcery for good measure. So basically, I didn't even chip them, did I? Okay. <clears throat> Let's try that again. One chipped teleport. Okay, so now the teleports take you over this way, which is... I don't have... My wicked head, do I? Nope. Uh, okay, let's pretend that I have my wicked head, <laughs> and uh, it takes me there. So you're like two steps away from the altar. You you like surge or like blade of die, whatever, in the craft your runes, and then uh, TPOA to a close bank. Like uh, deep sea fishing's a good one. Max skills a good one. You know, just anywhere that's close, and uh, it works an absolute treat. And if we go over to the water altar now, like I was supposed to do before, but here's I'm unfortunately very silly. Then we can see how many we make, especially with a power burst, because I feel like it should be quite a lot, because the multiplier is kind of crazy. Remember, I don't have a familiar or anything either, so... How many do I get? Oh, 600 water runes just like that. Isn't that just beautiful? So yeah, you just go uh, bank at, like, deep-sea fishing or something, and just repeat the process over and over. And, uh, yeah, water runes go up very fast. But look at that, that's a 62k. Dude, I swear I had, like, 90k yesterday. Um, but yeah, also guys, thank you so much for the, the nice comments on the YouTubes, I appreciate it a lot, I have read them all, and uh, makes me all warm and fuzzy. And uh, above that, let's have a look at the, the job logs. We have, obviously, <laughs> seven pairs of boots, which I, I'm so thrilled, <laughs> I can't believe I got more, it's actually insane. Um, but yeah, seven pairs of boots there. Still no bow pieces. So Kat and Diren are on uh, two pieces each now after today. And I'm still on a big fat zero. Don't know what's going on. That is what it is. And then uh, Crowlog, of course, spent two hours there today. 979 kills. Like, I, I have spent too much of my life at this boss and I hate it. Just get me out. Oh, I hate how annoying it is, because like, I really want this, the full set effect, it would help out so much at Zami. Like, I'm not really dying much anymore, because I, I got the fight down, but like, just having the, uh, the safety net of that fungal shield, especially for phase 7, oh, it's just so useful, man, but, oh well, maybe I'll, maybe I'll be the first person to 4k without a full crypt, you know? <laughs> I don't know, but... Either way, hopefully uh, you guys are still enjoying the climb. I am enjoying it, although I'm really tired, so I'm probably going to do the sleeping thing. That seems like a uh, a reasonably good idea. Um, but yeah, thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time.